What's going on guys and welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy, a game I am loving right now and we've received a owl post after the incidents that happened over in Hogsmeade. So let's open this right up and see what we have. So it's from uh, Professor Fig and it says, come and see me, I've discovered something in the locket we found at Gringotts. So Fig is kind of going to be driving the main story, it seems. He's going to be pushing us down the main story. We have our professors teaching us the classes and doing us some side quests and all this kind of stuff. And then we have students who are doing our, like, um, our primarily, primarily our uh, side quest. So without further ado, let's jump in and continue our adventure. So, oh, hello. Oh, so we can read our mail straight from here. Interesting. We got a quest. The Locket Secret. We can go speak to Professor Fig, which I am going to mark down, which it already is, to be honest. Um, and we got some inventory. What's this? Oh, so this is just stuff that we've been finding. We've found portions. We've found. So there's, there's, there's quite a few things we can actually find then. Interesting. And beasts as well. Which we know about because we can kind of put it into our little stuff later on, right? We got our wand last uh, last episode as well, so we're going to continue, like I said, and we're going to go and see what is in the locket from Professor Fig. Okay, so Fig's just in here, uh, and also if you're enjoying the videos, uh, remember to like, subscribe, and also leave a comment. I just want to thank you all as well for the support on the variety content on the channel. Professor Fig, as if my schedule wasn't congested enough, the Ministry has charged me with arranging uh, arranging the rather inconvenient arrival of a new student at Hogwarts, a fifth year, if, I can, if you can believe. Professor Weasley insists that they will need an, es uh, an escort and mentor to help uh, acclimatize before he begins. Uh, I have assigned the task to you. Please see Professor Weasley uh, for details. Professor Phineas... Uh, I never pronounce his middle name. Phineas Black, I'm just going to call him. Headmaster. Okay. Oh, he's not in here. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Wait. Why was I on the floor? What was that about? Professor, I'm glad to see you. And I you. Thank Merlin you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? Sir, the trolls were wearing armor. It had that dark glow like the dragon collar. Goblin silver. Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? And why send trolls to... They were there because of me. I overheard Ranrock talking with Victor Rookwood. Ranrock was in Hogsmeade with Rookwood. The trolls were Ranrock's distraction so that Rookwood could get to me. And he would have had Sorona and the patrons at the Three Broomsticks not intervened. This is great news indeed. If Ranrock's goblins and dark wizards are after you, they want what we found in that vault. Ranrock and what were uh, the lockets? Speaking of the vault, do you think that Ranrock is working with any of the goblins at Gringotts? I do not. Gringotts goblins aren't typically the friendliest of beings, but they have a great deal of integrity. No, I dare say after what happened to that poor banker, the goblins at Gringotts are no followers of Ranrock. They're after the locket. You said you discovered something in it. Yes, yes. I discovered an inscription. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. Clever enchantment. It's a map of Hogwarts, to be sure, but I do not know where it leads. It leads to the library. A restricted section, to be precise, and a bit beyond. Uh-oh. I see traces of magic there on the map. I suspected you would see something. Shall we go? I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But if our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. I'd like you to work with Professor Heckett a bit. 
before we continue. But, sir, how dangerous could the library be? Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after a book, but we should be prepared for anything. Once you've honed your defensive magic further, come and see me. Okay. I'll let Professor Hecate know to expect you. Okay, sorry. I was getting a drink, Professor. If you're watching this, hydrate. Um, okay. So, I need to go and see Professor Hecate, which is our um, dark hearts, I believe, isn't it? She's the person that taught us uh, Levioso. Repairer. Okay. I can't fix that. <laughs> I love how after the cinematic, he's just going to go and walk around now. I wonder what will happen if I follow him and just see where he goes. There's got to be an Easter egg somewhere, somewhere right? Is there anything we can... Rebellion. Check in here? Nope. Oh. Here we go. Oh, wrong one. So... Where is that painting? Is it in here? Let me see that again. So, uh, under the archway, possibly to the left side. Archway, left side. I'm looking for... I'm not seeing any... It can't be that far, right? Because I've got to bring everything back. I've got to bring the, th the thing back. Let's have a look at this again. So it looks like it could be on a... Maybe upstairs? There's another picture above a doorway there. And then there's a skeleton in the corner. What's in here? Nope, that's outside. The one, the thing that's given it away for me is the supports which they could be on the ground floor but I guess if I stumble across it you'll find out <laughs> aha there it is I'm not going to lie I spent about 10-15 minutes looking for this so now I've just got to <laughs> wait Accio. what was it Lumos. ah there we go so it was at top of the stairs. It was up high because I was looking at the flooring and then I started seeing these archways on the stairs and then I started seeing these. And it's literally all the way at the top. So now I'm going to take this all the way over here. And it's right here. I checked like downstairs and everything. Beautiful. I kind of like these puzzles. They're fun to do. Even though they take a little bit of time. I'm okay with it. Like, I searched down here. I went downstairs. I, look, I was looking at these pillars. And then I was looking down here. And I saw this one. And I was like, nope, it's not that. So went further down. And then I come all the way down here. Check these floor. And this is when I started noticing over here. These, these stairs here. And I was like, okay, they look familiar. So I just follow the stairs all the way up. Okay, so let's head to classroom because it's literally right next to us at the top of these stairs to the right. I ran past it a couple of times, I'm not going to lie to you. There she is. We all the eyeballs. Why is your... Ah, you catch your flies? we have some matters to discuss. <laughs> she just stood there with her mouth open. I'm here about the new spell you wanted to teach me, Professor. Good. Professor Fig indicated a certain urgency to you completing your defensive magic assignments. As such, you are to learn Incendio, the fire-making spell. Handy for lighting torches, burning away spider webs, 
And when necessary, defending against those who would wish to do us harm. Sounds uh, versatile. True. Right. But before we get started, I'd like you to complete a few tasks. You may be surprised by some of them. Of course you Astonishing do. Astonishing how much students don't think their professors know. When you're finished, come and see me. Then we shall begin working on Incendio. Okay, so what do you want me to do? You know where to find me once you've finished. Win two rounds of cross ones and complete a round of spell combination see, practice with Lucan Battleby. Okay. So let's go on head towards these. So I can see that there is a second object. No, it's not. It's the same objective. Sorry. It's just that I've not got up to that point. What's this? Revelio. Oh, we already found that. Whoa. Hello. So one thing I've kind of discovered is that you use the Revelio spell a lot. And I think if I ever was to start a new character, I'm going to call myself Revelio. So I can literally just like go up to a student and go, hey, you know, of course they don't say Revelio now. <laughs> but every time he does it, he always like shouts out Revelio. Like, hey, I'm Revelio. Revelio. It's me, <laughs> Revelio. <laughs> Revelio Spoon. Come here, my brother. Got more locks in here. Can't do anything with this. And I forgot what the uh, the spell is as well. Um. Is this the ladies? Look at your hair. You're gonna pay less. I think someone was taking a pee. Oh, I saw something. Revelio. Lachlan the Lanky. This statue de uh, depicts the wizard Lachlan the Lanky, a tall, slender wizard who appears quite proud of himself from what precisely no one knows. Got one of these as well. I forgot what we did with this last time. Lumos. Levioso. Accio. Repairo. Revelio. Um. What did we do with this last time? Lumos. Levioso. Definitely wasn't that. Was it? Accio. Repairo. Revelio. Maybe we can't do anything with it? Hmm. Maybe we'll come across a side quest. I thought I did something with that. I'm guessing one of you will remind me in the comments if I did do it. If it's something I haven't done yet, please don't tell me. But if it's something I have done... Oh, we're back at the the, the, the dueling place. Ready for another round? Of course, and I'm going to beat your ass. We shall see who shows up. There's no one in the school I'd be afraid to duel. Hello, Lucan. May I use the training dummy? Of course. Oh, I'll no. bet you can give you a list of combinations to practice. Oh. Ready to have a try now? Combinations? That would be wonderful. Be sure to cast all your spells before the dummy lands. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. What makes this guy the boss? Okay. Accio. Excellent form. Next time, perhaps. Repairer. Nope. Press the wrong button. Come on, Wheelie. Come back. Nicely done. So that's enough practice. You looked good out there. Thanks. Thank you, Lucan. I say better to discover one's weaknesses during practice than during a duel. 
You'll be a fearsome challenger now. <laughs> all right, well, can we talk? Because I need to do... Uh... Hello, Lucan. Is the next round of Crossed Ones all set? Why, yes, it is. I've got a great match lined up. Ready for another round? Indeed, I am. I'm ready. Let's do it. Brilliant. Are you dueling with a partner? Uh, you know what? Let, let's let's get Natty yes, in. Natty. Then let's get to it. Let's pull him in. Ready to get thrashed? Thrashed. Jeez, I've not heard that since I was in school. Apologies in advance. There's three of yous now. Three of yous. Adept round. Break through violet shields and force spells like summoning uh, charm. Uh, Akio, target. Uh, okay, yeah, we kind of. We understand this. Wait a minute. Break through violet shields with force spells. Oh, okay. Good job. I read it real quick. Damn it. Okay, we didn't do so bad. We got better at the end, though. Um, blocking. I need to keep remember to go to triangle well, and not circle to dodge. Wall. You did indeed. The other duelists have already taken notice of you, but after that last round, they'll really have it in for you. You'd better keep practicing if you want a chance at winning, or at least surviving the next round. Mm -hmm. I'll let you know when we're ready. Hope yeah. to see you then. So I need to remember when it's. The next Orange the above the head. Going, so I need speak. to use uh, uh, my my block. When it's red, I need finished. to roll because going up against the troll when it was melee, it broke straight through the shield and still did damage to me. So I need to remember that. But also weapon, uh, my one weapon, one my one cooldown. So when I'm doing spells, um, like my Accio or Levioso, actually. Depletes, so I can't do it. So Spark said it's coming out. So I need to remember that as well. So we're returning to uh, the Professor Heck. Wait, have we done everything? I don't remember doing everything. We did the... Did she want me to do training dummy and thingy at the same time? Well, I guess we can go and learn Incendio. I'm going to start burning some people, which is going to be more of a damage dealer, which would be good, to be honest. So I guess it's always good to have one spell of maybe each kind, preferably. One force, one lift, and obviously uh, my Levioso and Repero are utilities, so I don't really need them on there until... Time is I right. trust Mr. Brattleby was able to accommodate you and that you found success in your endeavours. Mm-hmm. I finished all of the tasks you gave me, Professor Hackett. Glad to hear it. Then you should be ready to learn Incendio. Oh, yeah. Should be, Professor. Yes. I'm sorry to say I visited enough careless colleagues at St. Mungo's to assure you that fire is a fickle servant. 
Your spellcasting has impressed me thus far, but please maintain focus. I would rather we not end today's lesson with your robes aflame. <laughs> Let us begin. And remember, focus on the proper wand movement. Concentrate and keep your wand steady. We got it. So our first damage spell. Lethal spell. You have learned enough spells that you'll need to equip Incendior to your spell set. To do this, you can hold this. Okay. Good work. And go here. And I'll just press. We're going to bring it up. Okay, so let's bring it for repair roll. Nice. Incendio. Levioso. Incendio. So it's short range. And we can see the cooldown at the bottom. Incendio. Getting it. Keep at it. Levioso. Accio. Incendio. Oh, we've got like these torches now as well. And he's on fire. Cool. Wait. Who do return to prof Oh, okay. So we can continue with Fig's mission now. And hopefully we can go and do one of the main quests. Wait, have we got a side mission down here? Who's this? Hello? Spare a moment. I could use your help. What can I do for you, you sir? To speak with me. I did. Hello, I'm Duncan Hophouse. Pleasure to meet <laughs> you. I've heard all about you, of course. Confronting trolls and dragons. Mm-hmm. That's nice to hear. The I names in the Wizarding World are hilarious. I hope my reputation's warranted. I'm going to presume your reputation is, in fact, warranted. In which case, you are precisely the person I need. You see, we were learning to repel boggarts in Professor Hecate's class, and, well, mine, unfortunately, took the shape of a... a puff scheme. How's that? They're adorable. Why would you be afraid What's of a puff scheme? scheme? They seem adorable until one sticks its tongue up your nose. Regardless of how reasonable I believe my fear of puff schemes to be, I'm beginning to get a reputation as a coward. Some have even <laughs> taken to calling me Puff Skeen Dunkeen. Do you like Dunkeen Donuts? It's <laughs> actually funny. Uh, I'm sorry, but you have to admit that's rather clever. I do not have to admit that. <laughs> Everett said the same thing. It's anyway, true. To make matters worse, Embrace I stupidly it, blurted out that I must be braver than people think, since I have been in the hidden herbology corridor. The hidden herbology corridor? Yes. Mm. Rumor has it that the herbology professor before Professor Garlic kept dangerous plants there. It's supposedly so overrun now that no one dares enter it anymore. I was hoping you could go there and bring back evidence that I could use to show that... Well, I'd gone in. Say a bit of an exceptionally dangerous plant of some kind. What sort of plants should I expect in the hidden herbology corridor? I haven't a clue. But have you seen the kinds of plants Professor Garlic grows? If the previous professor was anything like her, I'd imagine they're not exactly harmless. Very well. If I'm in the area, perhaps I shall take a look. Grand. I'd very much appreciate it. Come and find me if you get the proof. I shall be forever in your debt. I shall forever be in your debt. Okay. Venomous Valor. Hmm. Hidden Herbology Corridor. Sounds intriguing. It does, actually. I don't know if it's... Uh, locked off or anything, or... Like, I doubt we're going to get a... What's... Oh. Oh, God. The song's coming into my head. Do you remember from uh, Order of the Phoenix when Harry puts... Rebellion. The, um... The egg under the water and it sings. This ornate fountain features in... Intricately... 
I just read that so wrong right there. Uh, <laughs> intricately carved statues of denizens of the magical world, including a set of stone sirens encircling at the fountain base. Kind of low-key too. Why was that glowing up there? What's this? Hello? Nice. Oh. Wait, isn't that... What's it called from... Um... Hufflepuff? Oh. That was kind of lucky, I'm not going to lie. Revelion. Oh, we didn't see that before. We was in here with the bells. Flattened armor. This set of armor belonged to Sir Skagglethorpe, the headless who, who unwisely challenged a mountain troll to a game of musical chairs. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, we're back outside again. Wait, can we just randomly go outside now, or...? Whoa, is that a dragon? Rebellion. Whoa. Nice, we got 15 out of 15 pages. So we've just got a challenge complete, which means we should... Challenges, sorry. Um, quests. So we just got a new scarf. Not got that one yet. These are still in progress. But we have got the field pages now, which are the red gloves. Oh, those, what, what is that? Oh, God, Zonko's chief prankster hat. But we have got a new scarf. Let's have a look at this one. So it's an appearance scarf. Let's put this one on. And then give us the red one, right? That works. Now it looks like we're in Gryffindor. Oh, what is this? What's this area? Find and enter the hidden herbology lab. Levioso. Incendio. Okay, we don't do any of that. Revelio. Glumbumbles are magical flying insects that produce a treacle which will cause uh, mel mel melancholy if consumed. They feed on nettles and nest in dark and scheduled places, uh, secluded places. Unfortunately, they are known to infest beehives, having a devastating effect on the honey therin. Therin, they're in. Jesus, I just can't speak English today. Rebellion. So we're looking for a hidden door. Wait, it's over here then, right? It's over. Wait, oh, it's telling me to go down, but it's downstairs still. Incendio. Oh, can I not like that? No, I guess not. Okay. So it's down here. Ah, uh, here we go. These dry vines are one spark away from becoming kinky. Becoming kinky? Incendio. You can see why you need certain spells to enter places, right? 
Oh. This must be the entrance to the hidden herbology corridor. Oh. Devil's I'm not... snare seems to thrive in darkness. Perhaps it doesn't care for light. I know this. It was in the first Harry Potter film. Devil's snare, devil's snare. Something about the thing and something in about the sun. Incendium. Uh, how do I get over there? Like that. Curious silver. <laughs> Please hold. <laughs> Please hold. Please hold. <laughs> we gotta put them on right i need to check all my uh stuff here because i feel like i'm not equipping stuff that is high level and i'm just kind of skipping on stuff let me just double check everything here and then change the appearance of it if i can do okay we're fine okay can I just jump down here? Lumos. I imagine a piece of that enormous venomous tentacular would be enough for Duncan to prove his bravery. Oh my god. What do I need to do with this? Incendium. Collect it. Oh. We just grab it like that. Uh oh. Lumos. I thought he had like creepy spiders coming up behind me. Incendium. Lumos. Incendium. There we go. Lumos. Lumos. Incendium. Protego. Lumos. Enter the greenhouses. I wonder if we're going to do like a, an herbology class. I also wonder if the Whomping Willow is going to be in this. Lumos. These plants look, like, freaky. Oh. This is a big chest. Black rivet gloves. Oh, I need to be level 10 to get 23 offense. What level are we now? Level 9. Okay, so one more level. And we can pick it, pick it up. Lumos. Is there any other plants I can collect in here? Because if so, I might as well grab them. Just for my own portion making. Or growing anything myself. So pretty though. They've done a really good job on designing. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. Designing this. Like, and we're only inside Hogwarts. To be honest, we've seen Hogsmeade, but I'm looking forward just to exploring the other lands, the other biomes. Would you say biomes? I guess we can, right? Everyone understands what we mean by biomes, right? Different areas, 
different enemies, different levels. You know. There is a chest around Rebellion. here. It seems to be downstairs. But it seems to be under the stairs, and I can't seem to find it on here. Lumos. I love how quiet it is. Have you found anything to uh, prove my bravery yet? Yes. Hello, Duncan. <laughs> I have the proof you wanted. That's one leaf. Must have been a giant venomous tentacular. <laughs> It's even more than I expected. How would you like my glasses? I knew you were the one to ask. I appreciate you getting it for me. Of course. I hope this helps you <laughs> prove yourself. <laughs> this is sure to put an end to Puff Scheme Dunking for good when I show everyone in the common room tonight. This will show ever how ridiculous that nickname was. Thank you again, and have a good day. I know I will. Thank you for all of your help. No more puff scheme dunking for me. No, no. Wait, did I just get a new robe? What robe was that? I, was, I keep pressing the big button on the PlayStation 5 controller. I should really go into this and then go here. Um. So I just... What did I just get? I think it was a robe, wasn't it? Or was it a decorative robe? What did I get? It was. It's a green robe. A venomous tentacular robe. I kind of like it, but I think I'm going to stick with my black and gold. With my good old glasses. What's this chest coming up here? All right, it's got these. I don't want to go through these like whilst I'm recording and all that kind of stuff. Because that will take some time. Have we got another signed quest up here. I think we do. Like I said, I am going to be Rebellion. going through side quests and all that kind of stuff with this Let's Play. And... Lumos. Oh, I've not seen... What is this? Please do be mindful where you walk, won't you? Only if you step on the wrong tile, there's a... Oh, dear. Wait, what happens if I step on it? Okay, so... Oh, here it is. It's right here. Where's... It's there. I kind of like going around the school at night time. It's pretty cool. It's quiet. It's mysterious. Wait. It was behind this door, wasn't it? There you go. Thank you. Pushing me to that level 10 for that good old offensive. Um, okay, so we need to head upstairs now. I'm glad the game doesn't kind of force us to... Um, go to bed at certain times. You know. Who is this? And what do they want with us? Oh, they're even further up. So many floors to this place. Oh, we've got to wait until morning, of course. So Hello we're just going to sit here. Perhaps you can help me. <laughs> okay, so side quests are only available during the day. Um, obviously, when the students are out, it makes, can, makes sense, Hello. right? Hello, <laughs> were you calling me? I was, yes. Thought you might be interested in joining glasses, me for a man. bit of an adventure. These glasses. The treasure map to <laughs> Hello. Precise. Slight respite from battling the odd troll, I should think. Asked Poppy if she'd be interested as well, but couldn't drag her away from her puff skein. I found two maps lying about, both leading to locations around Hogwarts. Care to have a look at one? Ooh, a treasure map. Following a Hogwarts treasure map. Count me in. Wonderful. Hogwarts fascinates me. You can keep whatever treasure lies at the end of your map. I'll be satisfied just knowing where it leads. Where do you suggest I search first? Hmm. 
Based on a cursory review of your map, I'd suggest somewhere near Hecate's classroom. Okay. Very well. I shall take a look if I can find the time. Fair enough. Meet me back here if you find anything. Oh. Okay. So I know this room. This is where... That's the gardens, isn't it? The gardens. So it depends on where do I go start from first. Do I go here to then here to here to here? Kind of like a, how a comic book works. Hmm. Curious. Very curious. <laughs> Here's this. And there's Hecate's classroom up there. Ah, a rhinoceros skeleton. I'm on the right track. Yes. Is there a way I can look at this picture? Whilst I'm here. Wait a minute. There's an icon on the map. That's telling me to search in this location now. Oh, I thought it was going to give me, like, allow me to do it. So here's the other statue. There's the fountain. I'm yep. getting closer. The Dedalian keys are back. Aren't they brilliant? Please hold. And now... We need to look for the picture, and I can't remember which one it was. The stairwell looks promising. Oh. Okay, please hold. This looks like the portrait from the map. And where's the treasure? Akio. Uh -huh. There was a doorway hidden within the portrait. Wow. I wonder what came of Arthur's search. <gasps> Look at that. Cl I did it again. Look at that clock. Is it a skin? It is. Look at this. That's kind of cool. I kind of like it with the uh, the red. Or we could go with the white. I don't. I don't want that. Wait, please hold. Okay, we want that on, but then we want the skin. Kind of go with the red hood, right? We can't get the gloves yet because of, obviously, level 10. Which are locked. And then the glasses are for the memes. <laughs> He's jumping in a conversation going, hello. Okay, so am I heading back down now? I'm guessing I'm going back towards him. Return to Arthur Plumley. That is precisely where I'm going. I believe there's someone else wanting a side the quest out here. Are back. Aren't they brilliant? Hi, Nelly. Hello, Nelly. You seem excited about something. The Dedalian keys are back. The what keys? The Dedalian keys. Surely you've seen them flying about. Dedalian Rumors keys? That a former headmistress, Professor Moll, conjured them to protect the contents of certain locked cabinets years ago. Professor Black couldn't be bothered to disenchant the keys, and they appear every few years. You should try to catch one. Why would I do that? Each key will lead you to a locked cabinet somewhere in the castle. Ooh. If you can manage to get the key into the cabinet lock, not an easy task, you may find a reward. Why would Professor Mole conjure flying keys? What I heard is that it had something to do with keeping peeves out of things. But that may or peeves. may not be true. The joker a of, of a ghost. I thought they could go almost anywhere. Surely you will be trying to complete the challenge as well. Ah, uh, I've tried. And I can't even get past the first cabinets. Perhaps you'll have better luck. I'd love to know what's in the cabinets. Perhaps I'll give it a go. I hope you do. In fact, I think I heard one of the keys in the astronomy tower. You should listen for them. 
listen I for them. Keys, at least. If you manage to open a cabinet, I'd love to. Revelio, if anything. Do, 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 do. Oh my god, there's so many flights of stairs to go up. Like, I'm just constantly going up and up. And up and up. And up. Is it not a lift? <laughs> Wait, is that a. Accio. Page. Oh boy, we are going high. Let me answer. Revelio. Revelio. Ravioli. Hey, what was that? It was like a galaxy map. Kind of. But I've not been up here yet. There's just so much. Tapestry of Barnabas the Barmy. This tapestry depicts the wizard Barnabas the Barney's uh, foolish attempt to train trolls for the ballet. One can only imagine the impact on the arts uh, had he succeeded. Is that Headless Nick? I thought... No, it's not Headless Nick. God, this is a journey to get up here, isn't it? Duncan owes his reputation to you. Who? Me? Revelio. Okay, so we're going to go through here, but there is something shining in here. What is this? My dear Satay, I've, 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 yep. You'll be pleased to hear that I have received word from my contacts at Cambridge who con, uh, conceded that they had in fact been incorrect in their understanding of meteor showers. It seems that an Irish astronomer and a British astronomer both built upon the work done by an Italian astronomer. All muggles, mind you, as far as I know, to propose calculating the position of the dust at Earth's orbit as means of connecting meteors to comets. Brilliant, really. One can only imagine what they might do with an enchanted telescope. Frustratingly, in my correspondence, I did feel that I had to continue using, uh, whatever that is, from my days as a gentleman scholar. Whilst I still find it rather exciting to have a secret identity, the reason irks me. I am so looking forward to our trip later this year to Janta Manta. What an adventure we shall have. I miss you. Dear sister, and do hope you are well. With love, such Rita. A nice little, I like little backstory letters and stuff. Is this the astronomy class then, right? I wonder if we get to do something in here. How nice to see you, my young friend. Why, thank you. Very nice to. Akio. Hello. A Dedalian key. I wonder where it might lead me. Oh, are we going to keep up with it, though? Like, speed-wise? Wait, I've already lost it. Oh, is it purposely meant to get lost? I hear it. Oh, it's there. There's the cabinet. How do I get this key in there? Um... Wait, slap. Oh. Oh. I see. You gotta time it right when it goes across the lock. Yes. Like that. <laughs> An old coin. Oh, house token. Perhaps Nelly knows what it means. Okay, so now I've gotta go. Wait a minute. Please hold. We should be able to just teleport towards her. Where is she? She's over here. Oops. Is this... Secrets? No. Quests. Wait. The dandelion keys. That one. Locate on map. 
And you are down there. So if we go to Charm's classroom. Right? Wait. No, outside there. And we can just travel there, right? Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Saves me going down all them stairs. Because <laughs> that was a long way up. I'm going to have to go all the way back down. Go through the maze. Go past the things we've already collected. But I might as well get there in a jiffy. And complete. Are you able to follow one of the Dedalian keys? The Dedalian key? Hello, game. Nelly. <laughs> I managed to get a Dedalian key into its lock. Brilliant. What did you find in the cabinet? A curious token of some sort. Looks like a Gryffindor house token. I'd better unlock our house chest. I call them Ooh. house chests. I've seen the one in our common room and heard there are also in the other common rooms. Keep an eye out. I wonder if I get to visit the other common rooms. I do hope you continue on. For so much effort, the prize must be something grand. Okay, so we see this through and find the Gryffindor house chest. So we've got to go to the common room and see what goodies we get. Okay, so we're getting pretty close. What the hell is this? Hello? Um. Revelio. Arrow Brown. What the? What the? <laughs> That's pretty cool. Okay. So keep keep looking out for toads, I guess. What the? Okay, so our common room is along here. Hello. Oh my god, I didn't even search this. Oh, technically we've not entered this by ourselves, have we? This portrait guards the Gryffindor common room, requiring a password from who wished to enter. She and her friend Violet are known to wander among other portraits, periodically helping themselves to vats of wine they're in. Okay. So the chest is over here. Get everybody in here. Oh, what is the snitch? This seems I'll need to find more house tokens if I'm to open this. Quite a few oh. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wait. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. All right, it says it in the bottom. <laughs> spoon. Bloody spoon bits. Let's have an apple. Okay, so we do have the other quest, which wait, find the remaining house tokens. Or oh, okay, so that's gonna that's gonna take some time. There's no way we can do that like instantly. That's always gonna be a side mission. But to get 16 quests like that, For a pint of sweet golden mead. so let's return to Arthur and finish this quest that we did with him, and then we should be able to go and see Mr. Fig. And talk to him regarding the uh, the secret library, forbidden library. You know what I mean. All right here we go. Find anything yet? Hello, Arthur. <laughs> Thought you might like to know that my map led to a doorway hidden within a portrait. Oh, how clever! Mine led to the boathouse. Barely found the treasure before I saw the headmaster coming. He shooed me out of there, but not before I got a few galleons richer. What did you find? I found what I believe is an authentic historian's uniform. Oh, that's hmm. lucky. Seems as though we both had success. Glad I enlisted you to join me. I'm going to guess we're going to be well, doing more of them. On to the next Hogwarts mystery. Wonder if a quick rummage round Weasley's office might yield anything interesting. <gasps> Level 10. Nice. Which means we can equip our gloves. Which are these. Oh, we do have a new handle for our wand. I'm, d I'm down for that. I'm down for that. I don't like the end bit on this. You know the little uh, owl? I'm, I'm not a big fan of that. Plus, I don't like the, 
the chunky little black thing at the end. I, I know like we can, we can hardly see it, but still. My my brain knows it's there. <laughs> okay, so we do got quest. Well, I do want to select our main quest right now and highlight that, but then also check. Is it our collections? No, our challenges. We're not really. We've got six percent done. So normally, when you normally have like side quests or challenges, all this kind of stuff, the campaign normally ends around forty to fifty percent. Normally. Do 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 do. Okay, Mr. Fig. Me and my glasses are coming to say hello. Ah, there you are. Hello, sir. <laughs> You'll be pleased to know that I worked on my defensive magic with Professor Eckert. So I hear. She tells me you've taken rather well to your new wand. You must continue to work with her and your other professors to improve your skills. That said, I don't wish to postpone our visit to the library any longer. So, shall we proceed? We shall proceed, Fig. indeed. I have work for you. Come. Headmaster, I'm with a student and my schedule Your is... schedule will wait indefinitely, as will your student. I would think that after all the trouble you caused me with Osric, you'd be eager to make amends. My office. Five minutes. Ooh. That man is exasperating. Unfortunately, our trip to the restricted section will have to wait a bit longer. But, Professor... We have no choice. It would be unwise to provoke our illustrious headmaster further. I shall find you when I've completed whatever toils I must endure. Can we do anything with this? This Rebellion. keeps... Glowing in the background here. Okay. Right, anyway. Let's go and talk to Sebastian. How far is he away? Oh, he's only downstairs. Where are you, Sebastian? Have we Sebastian met Sebastian? Sebastian mentioned sneaking into the restricted section. Perhaps he'll have an idea. Wait, the restricted section of the library? I don't remember him talking about that. I know there was the herbology guy, but... Wait, yes, I do. Yes, I do. Here he is. Sebastian, there you are. I was hoping to see you. I was in the three broomsticks after the troll attack and saw what happened with Rookwood and Harlow. Not many students have Victor Rookwood's attention. What was that all about? Uh, I'm not entirely certain. I've never even met him. Perhaps he mistook me for another student. If you say so. I won't press you now, but you will have to tell me what's going on at some point. You might need me. Maybe. So, why were you looking for me? I need to find something for Professor Fig, but it's in the restricted section of the library. <laughs> he can't get it himself? He was called away by Black at the last moment. I suppose I could wait to get a note from him, but... You want to show some initiative. Precisely. Who doesn't? You mentioned being clever enough not to get caught in the restricted section. And I am. Meet me outside the library tonight. And tell no one. What will happen if we're caught in the restricted section? Detention, no doubt. But a word of caution or two will help. For one, avoid Peeves, the poltergeist. Aside from wanton destruction of property, he loves nothing more than telling on the likes of us. God damn it, Peeves. How concerned should I be about the librarian? Madam Scribner doesn't take kindly to clandestine activities taking place amongst her precious books. So do all that you can to avoid her. She and I have had our entanglements, but I can hold my own against her. You may not be so lucky. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll meet you later. I'll see you tonight. Also, it's awesome that's going to skip the time for us. Noted. My bad. I had a quick message of somebody. Sir. 
See there? <laughs> That's the door we need to reach. <laughs> and those annoying prefects would love nothing more than to rat on us to Scribner. So don't let them see us. Understood? I can be sneaky. <laughs> Let's go. Hold on now. There's a spell you should know. The disillusionment charm. Good for getting places you're not supposed to be. Cast it and you'll appear as little more than a trick of the light. Just as long as you keep your distance and stay quiet. You mean I'll actually be able to turn invisible? Something like that. It's not as foolproof as a cloak, but those are expensive. And spells, spells are free. Give it a try. Disensemblement. Interesting. Me and my glasses. Okay. Oh, so this is what we saw when we was looking through it. So where is it? This one. So let's assign this to... Instead of the Infernus, I can change it, I guess. Okay. Keep quiet now. Okay. Gotta sneak. Nearby adversaries will sense and then investigate suspicious behavior. Being caught by authority figures will result in quest failure. Okay. I don't know how long this lasts. How long does this last? Um, if I can see you, the prefects might be able to as well. Be careful. So we can kind of be seen, but kind of not be seen. How are we supposed to get to that door? Like that. Past. The librarian's still here. Quick, behind the bookcase. You told me the librarian would be gone by now. I said usually, <laughs> but it'll still be all right. Do you see her desk behind me? The key is in the drawer of that desk. Now, here's what we're going to do. I'll create a distraction to draw her away. You focus on getting the key. I'll meet you outside of the restricted section. <laughs> you distract, I get the key. Understood. I said I'd get you in, and I always keep my word. Trust me. Sorry. Oh. Is someone there? Is someone there? The library's closed until morning. Are you not distracting her? Hmm. Must have been one of the books wandering about. Twit. She just did a runner. Nice. I got it. I got the key. That wasn't so difficult after all. How to find that book? Oh, that one's charm to look more useful than it is. It's fooled me twice. Never judge a tome by its cover, I say. Okay. Use basic cast while undetected to lure authority figures and enemies to a desired location. Aim with L2, grants position spell targeting and reveals additional spell targets. Okay. So we... Don't let her see you. My gosh. You 
see, nothing you see, nothing you see. No need for us to be skulking about. So what is it you've been looking for? I'm looking for a cure to help my twin sister, Anne, so that she can return to Hogwarts. Because Merlin knows everyone else has given up. Why do you think we'll find a cure in the restricted section? Does the Hogwarts matron have nothing that can help Anne? No. We've tried everyone from Nurse Blaney to St. Mongo's. But I can research on my own. No need to concern yourself with that right now. Let's focus on what you're after. Which is what, precisely? I'll know it when I see it. You're being awfully cryptic. Ah, so that's how we get in these chests. You have to be invisible. Oh, God. You see the hand? Levioso. Levioso. Lumos. Lumos. I like how he does the same spell at the same time as me. You know? Repairer. Levioso. Who have we here? Sebastian Solo and his new little friend. Out exploring where they shouldn't be. God damn it. Naughty, naughty. You'll get caught. Peeves, don't you? I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell. <laughs> oh, blasted Peeves. I've got to stop him or at least get to the librarian with a good excuse for all of this. How do I know you won't go to the librarian and blame this all on me? Why would I do that? I like having friends who are in my debt. Mm. Now go. Good luck in your search. Now, where has that damned poltergeist got to? I know just the spell to repair this armor. Repairer! Troll armor. This is getting creepy now. We're going into the dark pits of the restricted section. Of course, traces of ancient magic. Oh, there must be more to it. That's it. Oh. Leather sorcerer's hat. Where might this lead? Can we... I'll press the middle mouse... Middle mouse button. Uh, the thingy again again. Can I wear this right now? Or do I need to be a high level? I can wear it. 27 defense increase. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. We're definitely fighting some stuff down here, right? We have to be. Um. Ah, I need to wake up that rune over there. Akio. Levioso.
Oh, okay. That was a bit weird how it was going backward and forward. Not surprising. Guards at the ready. Let's get that ready. That works. You just killed your own teammate. Ooh, your gift of ancient magic accumulates by successfully attacking or taking damage. Successful 10 plus hit combos will begin generating ancient magic power ups. Collecting these will greatly fill your mag ancient magic meter and recover a small amount of health. Good to know. And then we've just kind of done that. That's the ability I just used on each of them. And you got I got two usage. Anybody else? Get that. <laughs> okay. That was our first death, technically. This must be the way forward, but to where? This is a larger one. Nearly there. Oh, best keep my wits about me. Uh-oh. There's quite a few of them in here. Let me 
Oh, it won't let me dodge. Nice. Okay, that was pr some pretty decent fights, and I was happy with that. You know, getting better at it. But it hit, is a book after all. But hitting that triangle there to try to block, but holding right trigger at the same time allowed me to do the repair or mid fight. What would be good would be able to quickly switch, have a button we can press that changes our cycles through presets. That'd be kind of cool. Oh. Dip your head in it. Let's see a memory. Who are these? Oh, it's these guys. was interesting. <gasps> it's her. You wanted to see me, Headmistress Fitzgerald, Professor Rackham. Miss Isadora Morganach, welcome. Professor Rookwood, Professor McCaw. We understand that you are adjusting well to life at Hogwarts. I am. Professor Rookwood. I am glad. Especially in light of your unusual situation, starting as a fifth year. As it happens, I was also admitted to Hogwarts as a fifth year. I've never heard of another like us. Miss Morganock, when we spoke yesterday after class, you asked about the beautiful swirls you saw years ago when we visited your hamlet. I recognized you all immediately. I cannot thank you enough for what you did. We were glad to help. And yes, I did see swirls of magic everywhere that day. My father insists it was my imagination running wild, but it was certainly real to me. It was not your imagination. Percival, Professor Rackham can see them too, but we have never known of another who could. I don't understand. What are they? The whispers or traces that appear when a particular form of ancient magic is wielded. Ancient magic? Few are capable of wielding it. Hogwarts itself is a stronghold of ancient magic. So if I can see traces of ancient magic, does that mean I can wield it too? With the proper training. But let us not get ahead of ourselves, Miss Morgana. Before I can train you to wield such magic, you must first master all that Hogwarts has to offer. A magic this powerful can do great harm in the wrong hands. It must be wielded by a select few. 
As such, we ask that you not speak to anyone about what we have discussed here today. Uh oh. Why do I have a feeling she did something bad with the ancient mic? I have a funny feeling. Here I am. Sebastian. I'm creeping out with my glasses on. Uh oh. Sneaking in the restricted section again! I had thought we were through with this mischief. Clearly, detentions are insufficient. I'm afraid I must take this to the headmaster. But that being said, Peeves informs me that you didn't come alone tonight. If someone has coerced you, I would have you tell me. You're a bright boy. Don't waste this. There was nobody else. I came alone. Okay. Oh, Sebastian. What will your uncle say? <laughs> F you, Peeves. F you, Peeves. Quest complete. Secrets of the restricted section. We are near enough close to a level 11. But we are going to end this episode right here. Hopefully you're enjoying these long-form episodes, these long-form videos of just pure gameplay. And hopefully you're enjoying it. So remember to like, subscribe, and also leave a comment, even if it's just an emoji. And as always, keep smiling and check out this other content right here. And I'll see you in another video.